Hello, welcome to 22 H&B Page. I just got back from out of town. Very tired. <laughs> I have not um, unpacked or anything like that. So this video is going to be different. Um, I am going to make a hygiene kind of video. So I lost some weight and going to Florida, eating my Haitian food, I gained the weight back. Um, so... Currently, I'm in the process of being going back to what I'm trying to do. Um, I'm trying to make life changes, healthier life changes um, for my body. Um, being careful what I put into my body um, and, you know, making sure everything runs smoothly in my body. Um, bowel movements and things of that nature. So anyway, um, so this video is not for the men because <laughs> i know there's some men that um watch my video so anyway um i used to wear um well i wear pads when i'm on my cycle um and if i'm light and i need to take my kids swimming on my light days and if i'm really desperate i'll wear a um tampon but i really don't like wearing tamp tampons anyway so my um friend which i didn't know about these um i heard about the cups i'll get into that later so anyway in target um they have these maxi chlorine free pads no synthetic um dyes or fragrance they have extra large overnight it's a uh, life proof period um 2XL wider back for extended coverage, moisture wicking, absorbent core, uh, pure cotton, top sheet sensitive on skin. So it was by women for women, and they give you 20 pads in this thing. Um, so it, it's, it's this brand, and then you open it like this, and here's the rest of the peri uh, period. <laughs> here's the rest of the pads. Because um, when I first got this, I was like, Dang, I don't want to open it and then I won't have a way to... You know, I'm used to ripping the bag, but at least it's a plastic bag. And this these kind of bags, it's like going to be a headache until I saw this thing that says live here. Um, so I'm happy to have this. I still have this uh, from when I came um, from Florida because my other friend, um, animal cruelty free as well. My other friend, so pretty much I, I, I want to say organic-ish, okay? Um, so anyway, uh, my friend, she was telling me about, so I heard about the, um, cup. Now the cup, they have different ways that you fold it, that you insert it up. Um, that made me a little nervous. Um, that made me very nervous. So, um, then she started talking to me. Then I went over her house one day and she had these things that I was like, uh, Okay, I didn't know what the heck they were. So these I got from Bugala, I mean B Bugaloo Baby. Now I got this from SD.com. So it's B-U-G-A-L-U-B-A-B-Y dot E-T-S-Y dot com. This is where I got them from. Now I paid, it was like a $1.75 five cents for tax three dollars and 31 cents um for shipping and it was 25 dollars. so i paid 30 dollars and six cents and i got a really good deal because this one is um baboon cloth menstrual um pads um pack nine with traveling bag so these are these can be expensive um and it came with a travel traveling bag on top of that so this is I just got it in the mail. So here's the traveling bag. So I'm assuming it's just like when you use cloth diapers and you have the bag. So you put the messy ones in here and then you, um, so when you get home, you wash it. So it'll be easier instead of you just putting a bloody um, cloth pad inside your purse or whatever. So they gave me two, um, three liners okay now the one my friend had you inserted it um 
but these yeah the stitching seemed to not allow me to do that so i would have to wash this by hand or by the machine um so they gave me three liners they gave me three regular ones regular pads and three overnight pads so that's pretty good that's pretty good so that's nine so pretty much it's a 10 piece because um uh, of this now so you take your underwear okay um let's pretend this is the underwear because it's going to be a lot for me to get up and grab a pair of my underwears and that might be a little creepy so um so let's pretend my remote control is the my underwear so you take the underwear just like you would do a pad and it has these little snap button snap things and then you snap it and then you put your underwear on like that and you you know do your business um so see this is the little button sorry i'm watching this uh, on abc they have they're having this um it looks like a documentary on scotty pippen um and i used to be a bulls fan i used to live in chicago so i used to be a bulls fan um so i i was around for all of that scotty pippen michael jordan Larry Bird, um, Jalen Rose, all those. Now, you ask me about anybody else um, now, currently, I can't even tell you. Um, so, I thought that was pretty cool. So, you guys, don't sleep on them. If you're looking for a, a cheaper cloth di diaper, <laughs> cheaper cloth um, menstrual pad, um, this one was the best one that I can find. Now, my friend has this one, and she also has the one that you could... Uh, slip in and slip out um, the the cotton part, I guess. Um, but these are okay. I didn't care how they looked. I just wanted um, some um, some cloth pads because um, I'm trying to do things differently. Um, now my friend, her daughter, just got her period, and I was because I wanted to find healthier um, choices so I can kind of see um so by the time my daughter start her period i will have a healthier choice for her um so like i said these they come in the pads at target they come in with the pads the chlor the chlor chlorine free um fragrance free dye free pads they come like this they also have tampons but they also have this ring yeah I'll open this one so, with this ring, IV wed. <laughs> I'm joking. So, this is the ring. Now, um, I mean ring, menstru menstrual disc. Okay, now these are, they have these, and these are disposable. They're um, plastic. Um, you can use them up to 12 hours. So, um, you could put them on. When you get to the bathroom, you wash it out. Um, very good hot water and then insert it back in. Now the thing, the way you insert it, uh, my friend told me how to insert it and then I kind of drew a blank. Um, so me at 36, this was my first time when, when I was in Florida. I started during my late, like when I was a, during my light days, um, which I'm happy about because I got to take a, get a vibe for it um, and feel comfortable with it. It didn't feel weird or anything for me, but maybe because I'm a mother of three. Um, but anyway, um, cause they also have a cup. My friend also let me know for the cups. They also have the cups where they'll ask you if you sexually active, cause that plays a part if you have kids or if you don't have kids. So they have different ones. So I'm guessing different ones are for different comfortability. Um, so anyway, um, this, so this disc, okay. Um, cause I wanted to try the disc and I figured if I could figure out the disc, then I could figure out a way to, um, work my way up to 
the cup because I really want the cup. Now, there is a club, um, a flexi menstrual club, cup. At, I, I, I know you could get at Target. I have been trying to get that cup. Every time I go, it's sold out. Now, with this particular cup, um, it has a black string. All of them have like a little thing, but it has a black string where if you push the string up, um, the thing could come out and then you just pull, push, put the string out. Um, so, and then it has a little hole so you could kind of put your pinky in there and yank it out. That was my concern because once you put this, once you insert these um, menstrual disc or this menstrual cup for the first time, you're a little tense because you're just like, you're trying to relax, but you're a little tense because you're just like, oh my God, because it's something new that's going in there and you're trying to figure out if you did it right or not. Now, when I first put this in, I did not do this right. <laughs> I didn't do it right when I first put it in. Um, and I'll tell you how I put it in and how you're supposed to put it in. But I did not do it right. And then when I tried to take it out, it was very hard for me to take it out because I was tensing up. I tried to calm down and everything, but I was tensing up. So, um, and, you know, it was like, oh, I can't go to the hospital because of the virus. How, what's going to happen? Kind of a thing because it's not deemed as an emergency and kind of a thing. And there's no way I could really put it up there. So I was like, you know what? That's fine. I'll just go to the beach and just be all right. So when I came, I had a little bit of blood on my um, swimsuit. Like I said, thank goodness I ch I'm trying this during my light days. So now for um, this month, I can try, uh, in June, I could try, well, for June, I can try, um, I could try it and see how it really works. So, um, so I have two of these. So these two are pretty much just gonna when things open back up and stuff like that when I go back to work and stuff like that um these two will be in my purse these two so in case I start my because sometimes you know when you're around ladies you pick up their menstrual cycle and it kind of mess up your menstrual just cycle that happens to me a lot I was the one that changed everybody menstrual cycle and then so on and so forth so and then my friend messed up my changed my menstrual cycle um so, um, and I changed my sister's menstrual cycle when I was over there. So, um, yeah, you know, so these disposable ones, which I need to buy me another box because my friend, I mean, well, I need to buy a box because my friend just gave me two. These ones, um, no, she gave me three. These ones, I, um, I will keep into my purse just in case I start my period and I, I at least have this with me. Um. So anyway, what I did is, okay, so this is my hoo-ha. What I did was I inserted it. I inserted it. And then I remembered when I got right here, because I was rushing, I remembered, oh, shoot, I got to tilt it. So then I tilt it like that. So you see how it's sitting? No bueno. So when I tried to take it out, it was like I was feeling this thing and, you know, you can't really tug on this thing to take it out because you see it's not coming out. You need to you need to get a hold of the ring. And a lot of people said you could just go in and use it like this, like go forward. But that was not my case. That was not my my case. Um, so I was able. So I was like, OK, whatever. I went to the beach when I came back. Um, when I came back, I um, now what I did, because what my friend showed me when I took it out. The way she told me, and I took it out also when I was using the bathroom. Before I used the bathroom, it was easy for me to take it out. Um, now, usually when I insert it, I just insert it the way she told me. Now, my friend, she told me um, to be in a sumo pos position. So pretty much um, squat all the way down where your butt is like touching the damn ground. Um, because you'll, it's, you know, your knees are up. It's, you know, you're everything is open and it just makes it easier and i found that it make it easier for me at least until i get used to it and then when i get used to it maybe i'll be able to insert it while i'm sitting in the toilet but i i can't do it um i didn't try it well no i did try it and it just i didn't feel secure so i just you know yank it out so anyway so you're going to take this and you're going to insert it and while you're inserting it, you have to tilt it. So you tilt it 
you tilt it, you tilt it. So by the time it goes to your hoo-ha, it's sitting like it should, ready to collect. Now, when you're taking it out, you can look for the ring and tilt it down and pull it down. Now, for me, I couldn't go through the front. I don't know why. Every time I try to go to the front, it's like I didn't have enough of enough grip of the ring to go through the front. If this happens to you, do not panic. Just go through the back because I, I was always able to go through the back, which can kind of cause a little spillage or whatever. But um, when I did, like I said, when I did that, um, at first I did it in the tub. And then the second time I did it in the, in while I was sitting in the toilet. So it doesn't, at this point, it really doesn't matter. So um, I grabbed it from behind. Currently, I grab it from behind. And then once I get it out, then I'm able to, then I switch over to the front with these, my pointer and my index finger and get the rest of it out and then uh, wash it you know, wash it up and stuff like that and then insert it back in. Um, these work good really overnight. And I think the popular, the, these are popularized because you can still have sex with this. Um, don't take my word for it. I didn't try it. Um, when I'm on my period, I don't feel like having sex anyway. So, um, but, uh, yeah, so I think that's the reason why this is so popular. Uh, for me, um, I just liked it. Uh, this is what my friend started with before she got her cup, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure if she started with the cup or not, but I, I believe, um, but this was a good start for me. So when I was looking to get the cup, it was sold out on um, Target. Now, it wasn't sold out on Target online. So I, I was like, you know, instead of me buying the cup over there in Florida, I'll just buy it when I get home. But then I was st I stopped and think about it and the cup still kind of made me a little nervous. I'm still going, I'm going to get the cup. I'm going to get the cup, but I think I'm going to do the same thing I did with these, um, menstrual disposable disc i'm going to use it on my lighter days the day i do get my um cup the cup is pretty expensive it's like 30 bucks 35 bucks something like that um the box i believe was like it didn't go over 35 bucks um it wasn't that much i don't want to say that but it wasn't that much i wouldn't remember the price for the disposable ones because like i said my friend gave it to me um uh, the pads are like six dollars and some change so that's a good price uh for the pads uh you get 20 pads with the with these um but um i know this won't be in a, a waste for me because i'm also using the ring so since i'm using the ring also with the pads then this will be good enough for at least two menstruals uh for me um now what she does is she use her cup and when she use her cup she's good with the cup but just in case she used one of her um cloth um menstrual with with these so this same thing um i'm gonna wait because money is a little tight right now obviously but i'm gonna wait until i could get some more money when i get some more money what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna order two more of these um so i so i can have one for my daughter and one for uh because i have two daughters so i could so th so i could make them like a nice little welcome to motherhood type um type of um, basket um, so yes so we have these then we have so because I was um very 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 nervous about um, the um, cup still I decided to get these I looked all over the place. I look on YouTube. I mean, I mean, yeah, I looked on YouTube and that's when I came upon these. And then I looked on, no, first I, I looked on eBay and then I came upon these. And so I looked it up on YouTube. Um, so I was like, okay, they, they should have a menstrual disc. Every menstrual disc was disposable. So I'm like, they should have one. Well, Luma does. Luma was having a sale. Now you guys probably want to check 4th of July to see if they're having another sale. Now, the only reason why I didn't rack up on this for my daughter's was because I don't know how their blood flow is going to be. Mine's is heavy. Uh, mine's has always been heavy. So um, I don't know if it's genetics um, because mine's is heavy. My other um, sisters is heavy. My youngest sisters is, is not heavy as normal. And then my oldest sister, the older that she got, it got heavy. Um, they probably didn't want me to tell their business, but they'd be all right. Anyway, um, so I got two of these. Um, now, they were 50 bucks. So I got... Um, 
it was buy one get one free so i was happy about that the only thing at first i really had to think about it and i had to add up how much i pay for pads not this pad but my regular pad um before um i had to i think it's playtex or uh, i don't know but i had to think about my overnight pads the one that come in the purple bag I had to think about those and I had to add up how much I, I spent every month. And this is the cheaper option. So this color is Unicorn and this color is Pink Love. And these come in um, the size large because, like I said, I bleed a lot. They come in these cute little bags. Well, at least the... Unicorn came in this cute little bag. And look at it. This is so cute. It has this little thing. I have not used these yet. Making this video, I have not used these. Maybe by the time I... um, In June. Well, when is June? Because I'm that this video might be uploaded before June. Um, then I'll be able to... Um, maybe give an update or something like that um i'll probably give an update once i get my cup and then i try the cup and then i'll tell you which one vibes better with me but anyway um so i really love the colors <laughs> i'm a colorful person but they put this tab once i'm more secure with it then i'll be able to just um cut this part off because if you know what you're doing you could just cut this part off but right now um this will be my first time using this one um and the thing that i like this rim is pretty much like the same uh rim as the disposable ones um you know where it's hard now they they have some discs where that part is a little is not hard and some of the women um i don't remember the brand but some of the women were saying that once you pull it down it's all flimsy i didn't want that i want i the same thing i have with the disposable i wanted in one that i could use now they had another disposable that you you have to change every three years i forgot the name of the company and i that was still a good investment but i was like i'm lazy i'm the type of person that when the three years come i'm gonna be like ah oh, dang it and the i have three kids my life is unpredictable my work schedule is unpredictable so what if when those three years come i'm not really working like that and i don't have the money to really get it you know so i would rather just get something that i i got it i'm good i'm done um because honestly when the three years come i might be forced to just buy the disposable until i could afford the new one and that's just spending money when i could just spend fifty dollars and get these um so these are good these are good um this part is pretty thick i'm not very thick but thick enough where i'm good um i don't see this ripping um the other one that you had to get for three years this part was a little flimsy um so anyway um if i could find the girl's video um where she talks about all these products i'll put it down below um so anyway so it's the same thing. You insert it this way. You tilt it, tilt it, tilt it. Well, you insert it, tilt it, tilt it, tilt it. Opens up like this. You have the cup. You're searching, searching, searching. As long as you see the tab, use both of these to then pull it down. And there you go. So this one is the unicorn one, right? Unicorn one. And um, you could get them on eBay. You could get them. Um, you, I'm sure if you Google, you could get them anyway. But I got them on the website because they were having a buy one, get one free. And I was like, well, and all of them was asking. All of them was pretty expensive. Now, I, So I was like, well, if I'm going to pay all that money, I'd rather pay all that money and get two. So I'm just going to use one and see um, how it goes. I don't really, because um, like I said, I was going to use, I bought the reason why I was like, okay, well, might as well just get two. I'll take one with me and one with me, leave one in my purse. But then I thought about it. I was like, well, if I don't use one, technically, if my daughter is a heavy ble bleeder, then I could just introduce her to this. Now, the weird thing that I found was, I guess it's because it comes, this one comes different. So this one is pink love, but it comes differently packaged. And this is the holder for it. So I don't know. Um, I think, I want to say they had three or maybe four different colors. I'm not sure, but these were the two colors that I picked. So this is pink love, size large. And then it was. Now, I didn't want to confuse myself. And because um, initially my mind, I was like, okay, I'm, 
I'm getting one for me, one for my daughter. My Again, my daughter is young. She has not started her period. But then after I ordered it, I was like, well, how do I know what size she needs? What if she needs a small or she needs a medium? What if she doesn't bleed as much as me? Then what? So when I thought about that, I was like, uh, well, I could always use one and just keep it in my purse. Um, I have really bad um, uh, luck where I um, be losing my purse and stuff like that. And I'll be really upset if I lost this. Um, so that's why I think for me, for my sanity, I would most, I would just put the disposables in there. Now I have, now I work out and the thing that really irritates me is that, well, that makes me paranoid. There is a certain smell you have when you are on your period. It, it's not like hardcore, but there is a particular smell you have on your period. You're bleeding. You can't help that. So I get a little paranoid when I have to do certain machines in her outer thigh or if I'm doing a group setting uh, um, exercise, I don't smell anything. Nobody says anything. Um, I let my friends know, let me know if you smell something so that way I could get up out of here or stop bending down or stop squatting. That's just me. Before I go on, before I, um, so by the time I get home, I have enough time to go home, wash myself, put a fresh pad and go to gym class. So I know I don't smell, but I'm I'm just that's just me. I'm just paranoid about that. So again, you know, you insert it up, tilt it, bam. Look for this, grab it down, bam. Um. So um. I like the way this silicone is doing this. This is pretty cool. I wish this one had the same thing. And the good the good thing is when if this is in your um if this is in your um purse, it just looks like it's a mirror or it looks like well for someone who doesn't know what this is, it looks like it's a mirror, it looks like it's some type of makeup. So it's something that you could just put in your purse and be good with. Um But like I said, me um uh, probably won't be doing that. Um probably won't be doing that. Um I won't be keeping these in my purse. I would just put the disposable and be done with it. Um, I'll keep those in my purse. Now, what I'm going to do when my period starts, I am, when it starts, it kind of starts. Um, so it's like by the time the afternoon comes, it starts heavy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with this one, the unicorn, because that's the one I love. And then I'm going to put this pad in there in the morning. And then when the afternoon come, then I'll use one of my, then I'll wash this one and use one of my um, overnight pads. Now, if I don't see a leakage, if I don't see a leakage, then I will just keep this pad on. Um, well, keep this um, size on, the regular size, and not use this. Now, when it comes time to go to sleep, then I will use this just in case there's an oopsie moment or whatever. Um so this is usually what my friend does just for extra, um, extra, um, j j just for extra, um, protection. So I'm going to do the same thing and see how that goes. And then I'll, when I'm telling, when I make an update video, then I'll be able to let you guys know. Um, but I'm going to try this for a couple months before you guys see another update video about this. But, um, Again, um, I'm going to link all these below so that way you could grab them. Um, I'll probably, um, yeah, I'll link these below. Um, the the, uh, the chlor chlor uh, chlorine-free pads, no dyes or fragrance um, pads. You could get those at Target, so I won't be listing those below. Um, but um, this pad... I will be listing this and this. I will, the Luma, I will be listing the Luma menstrual disc. I will be listing below. And um, you guys, comment below. Let me know if you guys use any of these things. If you guys didn't, because my friend didn't even know they had a, uh, a um, reusable menstrual disc. She didn't even know they had one where um, that went over three years. Um, she didn't even know that. Um, so let me know. If you guys use the cups, what are your tips for the cups? Um, so that way, when it comes to me, I can use those tips and I could see how it goes. Um, so you guys know what it is. Comment, subscribe. Peace.